seeking the best ski gloves for your snow adventures? We've tested 60 plus pairs in the last eight years, most recently pitting 21 top mittens and gloves for skiing and snowboarding against each other. Our experts took these models on snow for rigorous examination. The trial grounds are the same places you'll use your gloves, ski resorts, backcountry laps, cross-country, on snowmobiles, and ski mountaineering missions spanning across the US, Canada, and Europe. We also put them through controlled temperature and water resistance tests. Our assessments are based on the areas of performance you care about. The first product on our list is Black Diamond Mercury Mitt. The Black Diamond Mercury Mitt is the best overall mitten in our test group. It proved to be the most weather-resistant mitten, coupled with decent dexterity. It is unquestionably the warmest mittens we tested. The Mercury performed very well for its weather resistance in real-world use and our side-by-side -side testings and offered bomber construction. We like the additional features like its optional internal index finger slot for improved dexterity and the hanging loop for quicker drying or to hang from a harness while climbing. We love that this mitt comes with an insulated liner, which is much more dexterous than the shell. The Mercury's elaborate liner is built with 340 grams of Prima Loft, has a fleece lining, is covered with Dree waterproof fabric, and is seriously warm. The only downside of the Mercury Mitt is that it seemed to pack out a little faster than other models we tested. Overall, these mitts might be the best bet for folks who tend to run cold. The next product on our list is Gordini GTX Storm Trooper 2. Ski gloves come and go, but the Gordini GTX Storm Trooper 2 has been around for a long time, and we hope it stays that way. Our testers are continually impressed by how well this glove can hang with the big dogs while costing significantly less. This glove is more than capable of meeting the needs of the average resort skier. It has a lot of leather for the price, boosting its longevity into multiple ski seasons. It's also very waterproof, we never experienced cold or wet hands in these gloves. While these gloves are warm enough for most days at the ski resort, they can't compare to other well-insulated or heated models. They pack insulation around the fingertips, which hinders dexterity for general tasks and rules out fine motor skills, like opening small zippers or searching for items in pockets. We'd recommend a more dexterous glove for users with more refined dexterity needs, like on snow professionals or parents. Still, for the price, these shortcomings are minor, and we would recommend these gloves to anyone who needs high-performance gloves at a bargain price. The next product in our list is Hestra Power Heated Glove. Heated gloves are rising quickly in popularity. Their popularity has led to technological advancement. This year, the Hestra Power Heater is our favorite heated glove due to its high performance across our metrics. Even when the heat is off, they are still warm. The refined design and high-quality materials allow this glove to exhibit impressive weather resistance, substantial durability, and superb dexterity. The heating element produces enough warmth to keep your hands toasty for the first chair on cold mornings. When the heat is off, the heating element is unnoticeable. The only flaw here is that other heated gloves in our comparison produce more heat. They accomplish this by including bigger and heavier batteries, making them feel like hand weights compared to this Hestra model. If you are looking for the warmest heated glove on the market, check out the Or Capstone. You'll sacrifice dexterity and versatility for more heating power. For most skiers looking for a warming boost on cold days and early mornings, the Hestra Power Heater Glove is our recommended choice. The next product is Black Diamond Guide. The Black Diamond Guide is the warmest non-heated glove we tested, making it a perfect option for cold weather snowboarding, skiing, and mountaineering. Tester Ian Nicholson wore them during a summit of Denali on a day with a daytime high of 38F. He summited in 42F and has used this glove on 10 Denali trips since. We think the glove is warmer than several price-pointed mittens on the market. The guide features removable liners, which makes drying them a breeze, while the molded EVA foam padding on the knuckles and fingers adds protection and warmth. They are also super sturdy and easily among the most durable gloves we reviewed. 
While they can still perform many tasks, it's obvious that these gloves aren't as dexterous as most gloves out there. There's too much thick leather and insulation, which make the gloves super warm and water resistant, but get in the way of fine motor skills. Also, the inner liner isn't that refined. It's nothing special, although we appreciate the versatility that this double glove provides. Despite the above points, we had few gripes with this glove. The BD Guide gloves are deservingly popular due to their cold weather performance. Thanks for watching and hope you liked it. As always, all the links about the products will be in the description below, so if you want to find the best prices, and more information that we might not get a chance to mention in the video, be sure to check them out.